this side. Yeah, thanks. Well, House Democrats have been pretty clear that providing security footage uh, in a manner that would jeopardize protocols, the safety, the well-being of everyone who serves in this Capitol, including staff as well as the Capitol Police and visitors uh, who come from all throughout the country to experience the citadel of our democracy is an irresponsible thing. It appears that extreme MAGA Republicans may be putting the brakes on what was a clearly irresponsible act, but that remains to be seen. We'll have to figure out an appropriate way uh, to balance a set of interests in transparency around what happened during the violent insurrection, but to do it in a way that does not irresponsibly jeopardize the security and safety of all who serve or visit the Capitol. The first step and the most important step is to make sure that the Capitol Police vet all of the security footage that is even being contemplated to present to the American people. Once that happens, then we may be in a position to evaluate how to balance the interests uh, that include transparency as it relates to the events of January 6th. The January 6th committee under the leadership of Chairman Benny Thompson has done a phenomenal job of doing just that. There were protocols that were in place that the extreme MAGA Republican majority decided to breach, perhaps because of agreements that had been reached with some of the more extreme elements of their party. That's for others to explain. I can't really um, clarify why we find ourselves in this position, but the fact that we do find ourselves in this position means that the most important thing that can happen is that the Capitol Police are brought into this to vet all security video footage. So We're going back to this side. Back. That there are uh, reports in the public domain that concerns have been expressed. Uh, by members of the House Republican leadership team uh, as to what exactly has transpired and whether the disclosure of video footage could jeopardize the health, the safety, the security of the people who work at the Capitol or serve or visit the Capitol. 